You know, my first guest tonight, a huge star. You know him from movies like The Scorpion King and Walking Tall. Starting tomorrow, he'd be seen with John Travolta in Be Cool. Thrilled to have him here tonight. Please welcome The Rock. <laughs> On the show. Thank you. So good to be back. It's I know so where I back. swear you've been on many times. You're a good, you're a good friend to this show, and I don't know why I had to stop it. When you were walking out right now, I almost took you down. I almost took you. You almost took me down. I almost took you. I know you're a large man and you're experienced in fighting, but I almost took you down. I know I it's so weird. I know you almost took me down, but then when we were that close. You were like. Let's hear that again. <laughs> That's very accurate. That is, that is, right? that is the I noise I make like, whenever oh there's God. any danger. <laughs> or a dog that I don't know. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, okay, maybe I'll take huh. you down later after that comment. Um, hey, so thank you for being here. There's so thank much to so talk much. about. So much to talk here. about. Uh, first of all, you have successfully transitioned into film. You have a great film career now. But you walk around, there's still a lot of... The Rock merchandise from your wrestling days that they're sure, s- and it's yeah. still selling big. Yeah. Absolutely. Do you uh, do you approve of all that stuff? Do you get to do you have to sign off on all of it? No, I don't have to sign off on on everything. Uh, right. you know, for the for the most part, that everything is usually pretty cool. So. Pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool cuz I found this and, it, and I wasn't sure The Rock <laughs> sippy cup. <laughs> the Rock <laughs> sippy cup. And the only thing I was thinking about, it's like, you have a lot of cool merchandise, and you're such a cool guy, but you think, like, yeah, I'm a big fan of The Rock. Creep <gasps> <laughs> 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 juice. <laughs> You're going to rip my face off, aren't you? No, no. Just talk to them about the rock sit because. <laughs> That's nice. No, I'm going to bring that home for my daughter. She'll love it. For your uh, daughter, I know. <laughs> 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 Where's That's right. Yeah. Honey, where's my cup? Oh, goody. <laughs> my wife will uh, say, Dr- you know, drink your lemonade, Conan. No, I want my rock sippy cup. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you saw through my thing pretty quickly. Oh. <laughs> uh, now, let's talk. We're going to move on to other areas, but I had one question, which is during the wrestling days, <clears throat> Something that takes a lot of guts. All of your work, you, you, all your wrestling was done in the Speedo, which you would do, all right? Ever a wardrobe malfunction, all those moves, all that crazy stuff going on, and there's just a Speedo there. Anything ever sort of go wrong, should we say? Well, uh, there was this... <laughs> uh, there, was a, there, there was this one particular time I was wrestling, and... Uh, Unbeknownst to me, when I saw the publicity pictures uh, about a week later, uh, here I am, I'm on top of the ropes, arm up in the air, holding the championship belt in all my glory, and there I am, and uh, my ball had popped okay, out. Okay, well... Is a euphemism or something? I know. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Well, the, yeah, then, yeah. Uh, the rock and his pebble. Yeah. Right? <laughs> okay. That's no way, better. No, Boulder. Hopped I mean, Boulder. You, yeah. Boulder. <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right. Well, it's good that you moved out of that field. I think it's all going very well. Uh, now, okay. in in Be Cool, you're very funny in this movie, and Thank you're you. you're playing uh, your character's gay in yes. this in in this in this movie, and you do a really good job. You know, one guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Your one, brother. Yeah, one guy is very excited right now. Um, yeah, sorry, sorry. Uh, but uh, but you know, I was wondering, like, when you're getting as an actor, sure. did you use anybody? Was there anyone that inspired you to sort of connect with that character? Um, well, truth of the matter is, yeah, there are certain things that you look for as an actor, right. especially for me. I could be like as fearless as I wanted to be. Right. And you look for roles like that. Um, my character is an aspiring actor. That was me five years ago, probably about the time we first met. Right. Um, has no money. That was me eight, nine years ago. I had nothing. Right, right. And I was very fortunate that I had a strong, two strong gay influences, two men in my life. Right. Uh, one knew my grandfather really, really well, strong, passionate, truthful guy. And the other guy, um, I've known him for a long time now, so funny. And uh, I love the guy in Conan. I just want to thank you so much for... <laughs> Yeah. 
Uh, one night in college. And uh, I know. Three, four Hunt's apple beef. teenies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was four apple teenies, one night in college, and it follows me forever. Can, now, I, can uh, I still call you Conzie? Yes, you can call me Conzie. <laughs> Man, we're not airing this episode, I've decided. We're going to show an old F Troop episode. <laughs> now, uh, if, the, if the script had called for you to kiss a man, that doesn't happen in this movie, but mm. if it had happened, would you have, would, you know, and there's nothing wrong with that, but would you have, oh. would you have done that? Would um, you have been uncomfortable with it? No, I'm, I'm very comfortable with my own sexuality, which is a number of reasons why I took the fr- role in the first place. Right, right. I think um, it all depends right. on oral hygiene. <laughs> yeah, 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 you know, yeah. What kind Brunch of, tooth, what yeah, kind of right. toothpaste are you That's using? all it really means. What kind yeah. of lips, you know, yeah. soft. Exactly. Hard lips. <laughs> kind of like your lips, Conzie. <laughs> By the way, if you, if you could sip the sippy cup again, then... The... <laughs> Man, this isn't going to air. This isn't going to air in huge chunks of the country, this show. <laughs> well, I will, and, uh, you know, in a serious note, you, uh, you, you do a really good job. You've done a very good job Thank transitioning into acting. And, uh, and this, is a, this was a cool role for you to take because yeah. what, what's neat about this character is that the fact that he's gay is just not really important to the no. plot, but he's, al- he's also a tough guy at the same time. Yeah. And, fu- and you get to be funny in this role, which yeah, is cool. absolutely. And I loved it. Not only that, but get a chance to work with all these great actors. Right. Uh, from Keitel to Travolta and Thurman and everybody like that, Vince Vaughn, including... So, and again, you get a chance to jump off the cliff and, and see what happens. Right. And I had a great time doing it. Yeah, you're right. Here's it must be guy. weird. There's like these, there are scenes with you and it's like you and Travolta are, you know, the only two people really in the scene. Uh-huh. And it's, uh, and, it, and it works, but it's funny to see you like, this is something you must have dreamed about five years ago. If someone said you're going to be doing scenes with John Travolta, this would be a great thing. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. So it's like, yeah, I mean, not only that, but I'm, this is like a dream come true for me now, just making these movies and, and doing well. And, or just know, even be, being or, here with me on this show. Brother, let me tell you. I pushed it too far, is what I did. We, uh, we have a clip here. What do we yeah. need to know for this clip? Um, this, is, uh, this is the earnest uh, way of my character, Elliot, where he sees this opportunity. And he, um, he, he by the way, this is, this is everyday life. And I know it happens to you right, where people right. come up to us every day. Hey, I got an idea. I got a script. I got right, something. Right, right. And this is his opportunity to deliver a monologue. But instead of uh, delivering a monologue that's like Braveheart, he picks... Bring it on. Right. He, he, this is your character, wants to be an actor, and he picks a scene from Bring It On. From Bring It On. And yeah. auditions for uh, John Travolta's character, Chili. Let's take a look Here at this go. scene. You guys have to go to Nationals. <laughs> what is this, <laughs> money? We don't need you. Why are you so mean? I'm just trying to be strong for my squad. And I'm trying to make it right. You want to make it right? Then when you go to Nationals, bring it. <laughs> Oh, 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 bring it. Don't worry. I never do. <laughs> Scene. You do that well. You became a cheerleader. Yeah. Uh, well, we're all... Uh... Be cool. Be cool uh, opens tomorrow. We're all uh, very happy for you. Thank very you proud so of you. Much. You're a good guy. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank 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 you.